Just a minute. Over. Where I kept it? Hmm? Where I kept the mobile? Both audio video, okay. Audio video, both are okay. I am not going for further setting. It's okay, board is fully visible. Board, lot of space is there. Very chat. Okay, okay, we'll start. See, make a note. I will not keep on repeating the things which I told last time. Those who came to last time class, for them it is continuation. Anybody new, they have to start from previous class, then only come to this class. See. This is a beam we considered. Left side fixed, right side prop. That is our choice. You can take any side fixed. I will take A, this is B. This is C later. Span 5 meter. Prop cantilever of span 5 meter. Loaded by UDL of 60 kN per meter for entire length and a point load of 120kN at 1.6 from fixed end. Is the question correct? I remembered and noted the answer there. Is the question correct? Tell me. Is the question correct? What I told now question, correct? Yes. Now, question is, see, question is, Analyze and sketch SFD and BMD first when first question when supports are unyielding. Supports when supports are unyielding. Remember, if it is not given, it is always understood. If support settlement is there, they should tell in the question. So when it is not told, understood supports are unyielding that is question one and question two is analyze and sketch sfd bmd if support at b support at b sinks by i think 20 millimeter correct sinks by 20 millimeter correct sinks by 20 millimeter is it sinks by 20 millimeter Yes, and tell me what EI I told, sinks by 20 millimeter and for that second part, take EI equal to, 
I think 25,000, if I remember. 25,000 kilo newton meter square, if I remember. 25 or 20, I don't remember. How much I told EI? 25, okay. That's the question. Okay, now, note, both, see, now, this is prop, this is actually, first of all, I need not tell. This all told last time. Still, briefly, Propped cantilever is statically indeterminate to first degree. Someone will ask, why first degree? Okay, 100 degrees, you solve. For you, 100 degrees. You leave my class, solve for 100 degrees. Okay. Then, solution one, which was last time over. Last class fully over. SFD, BMD still pending. See, I made ready for SFD, BMD here. Because, irrespective of you solve different approaches, you take whatever rendent. Finally, the result should come correctly same. Therefore, SFD, BMD common. Last we will draw. Now, see, VA, VB, MA. Three unknowns are there. Equilibrium, only two equations. Shortage of one equation. So, you can choose either VB or VA or MA. But choosing VA is problematic. Because then, see, if you choose VB as rendent, when you remove VB, this will become cantilever. Okay. Happily, you solved last time. Now, today, I am removing MA. When I remove MA from the fixed end, I am releasing the reacting moment. Tell me, when the reacting moment is released from a support, that support will behave like what? When the reacting moment at the support is released, that support will, that support I told you, not other beam, that support will behave like, no, that's not simply support beam, that support will behave like, simply support beam later, simple support, okay, now, last time, when you removed VB, see, VB removed, A is still intact, one side fixed, one side free, this prop cantilever is reduced to cantilever as Determine structure. Now, second solution, I am discussing MA rendent. See, this MA, I will take rendent. I will put a color. Color already put there. You can see the color. Okay. Red color, I am not having here. Okay. Where is the red color? I require red color for it later. When I require, I won't get it. Uh, it's there. See, I will take this MA as rendent. So, second solution. Remember, I am solving second solution, MAS rendent. Remember, solution 2, solution 2 for question 1. What is question 1? Question 1 is here. When supports are unyielding, I am solving that question. Okay, start. Don't see this one. Support B sinks right now, don't see. That is a second question. Okay, start. Do not see this one now. As rendent. Now tell me. Now, Therefore, tell me what is the compatibility condition to be satisfied? Tell me. Therefore, compatibility condition, compatibility condition to be satisfied, to be satisfied is, see now, when I remove, when I remove the VB, then point B will vertically deflect. It cannot deflect. So, compatibility was deflection at B equal to 0 or displacement in direction of VB equal to 0. Same way here. When I remove MA, this fixed support will become simple support. Other support will remain as it is. When fixed support becomes simple, see, fixed support, elastic curve will come this way. Theta equal to 0. But simple support Slope will be there. So the moment I remove MA, then for the beam, it will develop slope at A. But actually, A is fixed. Tell the answer. What is the compatibility condition to be satisfied? And tell me. Compatibility condition to be satisfied for this solution. No. Compatibility condition to be satisfied for this solution. When I remove MA, I can remove MA. But what I should do? I should, if I remove MA, I have to ensure that original condition is maintained. It is originally fixed end. 
tell me originally fixed end now we are changing it to simple support therefore you are allowing for rotation first of all it is a fixed end tell me theta a equal to zero very clearly satisfied is right theta a equal to zero tell me fully clear or you can remember one thing easy method compatibility condition is displacement in the direction of redundant should be zero if it is unyielding support or displacement should be equal to given sub, given settlement if it is what yielding support see second question see remember 20 mm is something else so theta a equal to zero fully clear theta a zero fully clear no compatibility condition is last time deflection at b zero now theta a zero fully clear why theta a zero okay start now get now what you do for the given structure which you took redundant you took ma as redundant so what you do release the redundant releasing redundant redundant that is ma we get what a structure which is this way here simple support maintain as it is here fixed support this ma is removed that also become simple support ab tell me what is the name for the structure short form what is the name for the structure short form don't write full name for the structure which you get after releasing redundant simple support beam no 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 it is not called simple support beam it has got a name simple support beam is a type name simple support beam is it what becomes name for that one ayyo so fast forgotten simple support beam is what it becomes there is a name for that one bds don't write bds it is called what basic determinate structure you write fully don't write bds i can write because i explained last time if you want to learn you write basic determinate structure in the bracket right which in future we will call bds okay done now what you do is now tell me one important note tell me one important note last time right vb was redundant write a note here last solution vb was redundant therefore your calculation was vertical displacement at b last time this time compatibility is what theta a equal to zero therefore this time you should concentrate on calculating only what tell me you require only what now to satisfy the compatibility condition now you should can see calculate only what now see what you require for compatibility for the basic structure you have to calculate only what now deflection is not required see the compatibility for the basic structure you require only what for the basic structure you require only theta theta means with theta i do not want theta b nobody wants theta b i want theta a make a note now our full calculation is for theta a over start now i will remove this one this i remove i want the space i remove this one question i remove after i complete the solution i will tell solution 2 uh, second question i will tell same question you write when support b sinks by 20 mm okay i'll remove this one start now first step by step see consider bds consider bds with the loading with the loading so it is a simply supported beam with udl and point load okay see here point load is 120 kN from here to here is 1.6 meter this is 3.4 meter 
and full span is 5 meter. UDL is 60 kilonewton per meter. This is A, this is B. Now, remember, I want elastic curve. See, the beam will bend like this, this way. So, this is the point A. At A, draw a tangent. Tangent at A. There will be a slope at A. See the slope? The slope will be in clockwise theta A. Remember, no sign at present. Sign will come later. When you calculate with the correct direction, you should not write sign. You don't know. So many people, I will tell you, online classes. I recently saw yesterday. They will put a point load here, W. They will write anti-clockwise, M bar A B. They will tell clockwise here, M bar B A. You may not believe, you know what they are writing. This is anti-clockwise. They will write minus WL by 8. This is plus WL by 8. Utter nonsense. Utter nonsense. Why? You already considered anti-clockwise. Once you consider anti-clockwise, you should not write. If you write anti-clockwise, write minus WL by 8, it will become clockwise of WL by 8. Once you write this way, do not write minus or do one thing. You do not write anything here. When you calculate, write M bar A B clockwise positive, then put minus. Writing minus here is height of nonsense. Agreed? Writing minus here is height of nonsense. That is called that much basic mathematics is not known for them. When they show correct direction, then sign is not to be used. Okay. Now start. Leave it. Let them have. Now this theta a you want. Tell me. How to find the theta a? Already I marked here clockwise. How to find theta a? See. For point load, I will write formula here. If it is a point load. Okay. I will put somewhere here. See. If it is a point load here. W is the load. If it is A from here and B from here, span is L, beam will bend like this. Okay. Then this slope will be equal to yesterday I told the formula load W into A into B, A into B divided by 6L divided by EI into length plus if I want this theta length plus other distance L plus B. This theta I do not want. And also I told you, if it is UDL U of W per unit length, span L, bends this way. This slope is clockwise of W L cube by 24 EI. So start for point load. First I want for point load. 120 into 1.6 into 3.4 divided by 6 divided by span 5 divided by EI into total length is 5. 5 plus, tell me how much? 5 plus how much? I want theta A. So 5 plus how much? 5 plus. 5 plus number. 5 plus 3.4. 3.4. This is due to point load. Continue. Plus. Bracket is still open. See, this is due to what point load. Okay, now for UDL, intensity 60 into span cube 5 cube divided by 24 EI over. Therefore, tell this answer first. Tell this answer first. Correct? calculate and tell the answer. Correctly calculate. Tell the answer. Don't make any mistake. Don't give three, four values. Give one correct value. No mistake allowed. I am removing the formula now. That space I am removing. Fast, fast. This much time to give that theta a this much time. You are wasting time. See, you should give it. Don't give wrong answer. Let one more person give the answer. After some time, if answer is not telling, I have to check everything then. 
ओके फोर नाइंटी फाइव पॉइंट टू एट फोर थैंक यू फोर नाइंटी फाइव पॉइंट टू एट फोर बाई ई इज द आंसर रिमेंबर दट इज थीटा ए इन वाट डायरेक्शन क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन आई एम नॉट राइटिंग यर नेक्स्ट फर्दर नाउ आई विल रिमूव दिस वन नाउ वाई I do not see. This is not required now. Those who want can make a note. I will remove that space. Tell me. Now, anything else is there? Nothing else is there. Now, I write here. Consider once again basic determinant structure with redundant M B. Redundant M B. Yeah, it is not redundant M A, not M B. Now do one thing. See. Now, because of loading, what happens over? Because of moment m e, see m e, redundant m e. This also very equally easier m e. Okay. B D S C simply support beam. You apply that m e. See m e is considered in the anti-clockwise. Don't put minus sign m e. Now tell me, if you put this way, the beam will hog or sag. You take a simply support beam. Yet by a couple here, beam will hog or sag. Beam will hog or sag. It is better to decide whether the beam will hog or sag. Beam will hog. See, elastic curve will come this way. Remember, I told you where you apply couple more slope, draw a tangent here. So. This is anti-clockwise flow. Ah, uh, this side, this is, see, this side call theta a one. This side, ah, uh, theta a one. This side will call theta a two. Theta a two. Okay. Now calculate theta a two equal to formula is what? General formula. I write once again if you want. Simply supported beam. You write if a couple m is applied. I will show sagging here. No problem. Okay, hogging only. Okay, if the couple m is applied here, b will hog here. The slope formula is m l by where you apply the couple slope is m l by three e i, three e i. Therefore, here m becomes m a into l is five divided by three e i. Tell me, is the slope no plus minus? Is the slope? clockwise or anti clockwise do not use sign using sign is nonsense why because i have shown the direction there this slope is clockwise or anti clockwise this slope at a other slope is not required for me this slope is anti clockwise or clockwise fast fast anti clockwise so right here theta a is that much anti clockwise over now therefore that's all now consider compatibility condition compatibility condition that is theta a equal to 0 see now you require sign sign is entirely your choice clockwise positive anti clockwise positive whatever you want in india we take say clockwise positive Cut. Therefore, see here. Theta a or this theta a, I will write theta a one, theta a one. Okay. Therefore, see theta a one is clockwise. You get plus theta a one. This theta a two is anti-clockwise. So what I will write minus theta a two. That should be equal to zero. Or substitute theta a one. Where is it? Four ninety five point two eight four divided by E I minus theta A two. Where is theta A two? Theta A two is the anti clockwise. Therefore, minus theta A one minus theta A two zero minus theta A two. M A into five divided by three E I equal to zero. See E I E I. Will get cancel. Therefore, tell me what is the M A you are getting in kilo newton meter? Remember, whether you take clockwise positive or anti-clockwise positive, 
answer MA will come correct if assumed direction is correct. We assumed MA like this and you know it is correct. MA has to come positive. Answer. Answer. 297.17. Okay. 297 plus MA will come plus 297.17 kilo Newton meter. Tell me. See there. Answer last time. Tell me. See, the, see last time we got VB. Then using VB we found MA. This time we got MA. Is it same as last time? Tell me. Is the answer we get today by this approach changing the redundant Finally, answer is same as what we got yesterday when we took VB redundant. Tell me. Yes, exactly same. It will be always same till what? In Kannada, Surya Chandra Irotanka. Japtak Chand or Suraj Rahega. That way. See, I can tell till sun and moon exists. It will permanently it can even if sun and moon does not exist also it will come same amara it is never ending okay start now make a note where i should write note ah see i want some space here i can use it here because continuation space i'll see how much space available there you see when you write you should correctly write the way i am writing okay i'll continue the question here continue see Continue. Make a note. Those who want to make a note. For the beam, we took MA redundant. We got the value of MA. Now, MA is known. Now, unknowns are VA and VB. Therefore, now find remaining reactions by equilibrium. So, what you do? Refer to original beam. Refer to original beam. Do not now do not bother about theta, geta, uta, nothing. Do not see any of this one. This is our beam. We got MA equal to so and so. I want VABB. So start. Sigma M about A equal to 0, where unknown is there. Take clockwise positive. Take moment about A. I won't go there. It is already explained last time. Minus VB into 5 plus point load 120 into 1.6 plus 60 into 5 into 5 by 2 minus MA equal to 0. Substitute MA equal to how much? 297.17. Substitute the MA value. Tell me what is the VB value you get in kilonewton. What is the VB value you get in kilometer? First, substitute. Don't waste, don't copy last time answer. Substitute and tell me. VB. How much VB will come? VB. You substitute there MA. Last time, remember, VB is known, we got MA. Now MA is known, we get VB. 128.966 kilometer. Plus, 128.966 kilowatt. Okay, then lastly, sigma V0 take upward positive. Plus VA plus VB minus 120 minus 60 into 5 equal to 0. You know VB value. Therefore, get the value of VA first. Barabri. It will come plus 291.034 kilowatt. Okay, now write a note. Write a note. See now what I am dictating right now. We completed the analysis by taking MA redundant. Yesterday or last task, we solved the same question by taking VB redundant. Fortunately, for both, and we solved the question when support settlement is not given. We solved the question. When support settlement is not given. Okay, then what value of VA, VB, MA we got last time that is already entered here. And today, once again, entry is not required because same entry is for this solution. Therefore, now we will go for 
SF D B M D. See, to draw, to draw SF D and B M D for question one. Make a note. Question one means when support settlement is not there. Uh, ready beam. Correctly draw S F D B M D. And if required, draw elastic curve. I will tell further concept later. Okay. Now we will do it later. Why? There is a reason. We will do it. See, you should follow correctly how I solve. Uh, okay. Now do one thing. Tell it. Okay. I will draw later. Agreed. Agreed. Start. Now write. Yesterday we also solved the same question. Second question: When support B sinks by 20 mm, yes or no? Tell me. When support B sinks by 20 mm, tell yes or no. We solved the same question: When support B sinks by 20 mm, tell yes or no. Past yes. Now we will solve this question also. Same question. When support B, see second question by changing reagent with the MA reagent. So solution two, see for question two, question two means what? Question two means when support at B sinks by twenty millimeter. At that time in the question, they told take E I equal to. Twenty-five thousand kilo newton meter square. Yes or no? First question, E I not given because E I cancel. See here, first question, your E I E I E I cancels. See, that is not there. There is not here. E I E I cancels. Okay, now start. Solution two. Let us consider M E as redundant. Okay, tell me. Remember now, last time redundant was V B. Settlement is B, so tell me last time compatibility vertical deflection at B should be equal to not zero. Tell how much? Last time compatibility vertical deflection at B equal to what? Not zero. Last time. Last time solution when V B was redundant. Compatibility condition vertical deflection at B not zero. How much? How much? Twenty mm direction. 20 mm direction. No, no plus minus. Same later. 20 mm direction. Sinking. 20 mm direction sinking down. But unfortunately today, set see now very very important. Unfortunately today, redundant is M A. Tell me M A means what? Rotation at A. Therefore, tell me, will this theta A? So therefore, even if the support at B sinks, it will sink by 20 mm. Tell me, A is fixed end. Tell me, even now, after sinking of support also, slope at A should be how much? Tell me, there is no disturbance at A. See, disturb last time, disturbance at B. And compatibility at B. Therefore, consider it clear. You should make a note. Last time, disturbance at B and compatibility at B. Therefore, consider it clear or not. Tell me. Very delicate point. Last time, disturbance at B and compatibility at B. Therefore, consider it. Yes or no? Tell me. Yes or no? Pass. Tell me. You should write this one. After the class over, write. Disturbance is sinking. Tell me yes or no. Sink. Disturbance is at B and compatibility at B. Where trouble is there, there only correction. You are not answering. Yes or no. Yes or no. You are not telling. Last time I told. First, first. I told last time. Yes. But now this solution. Disturbance is at B, but compatibility is at A. Therefore, will there be any change in the compatibility? Change will come at B. Therefore, will there be any change in the compatibility? Tell me. At e, because support B sinks, is the any change will come here for fixed end? 
will there be any change for fixed end compatibility past last time i told you wear disturbance there only correction now last time see who got wounded he only went to clinic now who got wounded you went to clinic and bringing medicine for him so you are going to medical doctor and telling that my friend is wounded why he not coming he is not well he cannot come so please give medicine that medicine you don't take give to whom last time he he only will give to doctor clinic hospital and get take medicine this time on his behalf you go to what hospital tell his condition take the medicine then who should take the medicine you should take the medicine or give to him you should take the medicine or give to him tell me friend therefore this time you are going to medical shop or doctor shop bringing medicine but you are not using it you are giving to your friend so your condition remain same yes or no your condition is same no change how you are last time today also you are same way you are health no problem this example see clear you are health there is no problem clear or not you are health there is no problem tell me yes or no you are helping him your medicine should be to him your health is unchanged you are not agreeing no medicine required for you tell me yes clear okay see i will tell frankly this example is the first time i told in my life i never thought of this one because when i saw it here suddenly it occurred to me redundant here displacement there oh so don't change theta a equal to something theta a is still zero then i thought how to convince suddenly my brain worked what oh some example required money matter etc etc see it comes okay therefore still right here even now compatibility is theta a zero only what all i told you right including medical medicine if you want okay right now releasing the redundant you get simply support beam consider bds with the loading okay find theta a1 same as last time consider bds with the redundant me same as last time now if i substitute this way if you remember last time when i solved with settlement tell me this answer came how much second question that answer came how much tell me for second question that answer came how much second question that answer came tell the i don't one thing i write somewhere here i write somewhere here second question what is this answer last time second question see for question 2 what is reaction i think it is 12 kilo newton lesser 100 it tell 100 it tell answer last time you got the answer last time tell me for question 2 what you got here see you are not answering means what i can do you are not answering what i can do tell me what reaction you got there for second question 116 point 116 point 966 this reaction came 200 and alala 300 and how much this one this reaction 300 and 3 uh, 303.034 kN correct uh? this reaction for second question 303.034 correct uh, and this reacting moment came 60 more 357.17 kN meter came for second question correct tell me correct or not why is 60 more why 12 less why 12 more that is by personal knowledge you never bother you simply solve you do not try those things those tricks all such tricks you try only when you master 
Don't try those tricks. Some will tell. Sir, tell me, sir. Uh, if I tell you, I will tell what happens. What all you know, that also will go. I will tell. Certain things which I tell, you never bother. I am not boosting myself. I know my capacity. So, this is the answer we got last time. Now, if that's all we do, tell me, will we get the answer now? See, disturbance at B, but compatibility at A. Therefore, if you think that what, oh, disturbance at B, why should I take the medicine then? Will you get that answer? Tell me. Will you, at present, if you solve this way, will you get that answer? Will you get that answer at present? Tell me first. Will, no. Therefore, you have to what? Tell me. You are right now. You have to account for what? You have to account for what? Tell me. You have to account for you have to account for what? You have to account for thinking. So what you do is, anybody got the idea? Tell correctly how to account for thinking. Okay, I'll give you four or five minutes time. Can you think and tell me? Good for understanding. It will show you your real understanding power. Can you tell me how to account for thinking when Rendent is M.A. Uh, can you try? I'll give four or five minutes because I almost non-stop I talked. High points. Uh, can you think and tell me the answer? Another three, four minutes. Three, four minutes I invite. Can you think and tell the answer? Tell me. You will try or not? Suppose you try, you are not getting. Then you, you will be knowing. Okay. See, wh why I am telling you? Because if you try and not getting, then you will be knowing how concepts are important. Okay. I can tell directly. Sometimes it happens. When you ask, don't give. When somebody asks, don't give. You tell, okay, I'll give something. You help him after some time. He knows the value. He knows. As in the house, when the children ask for money with the father, every day he gives peace, they won't know the value of money. He should not give. He will tell tomorrow. So he will tell, I want new shoes. Next, next month. Okay. Next month again he will tell, new shoes required. What happened to your old shoes? It is slightly the problem. Wear it one more month. Let me see next month. That way, push for three more months. Then he knows the value of that one. If he asks, give suddenly, then he will not be knowing the value. Yes or no? When you struggle and don't get the answer, then I tell the answer. Then, it will remain for a long time. Tell yes or no. You struggle. If you don't get the answer, if you get the answer, well and good. I will be happy. If you get the answer, I will not be jealous. Remember, I will not be jealous because you came to learn from me. When all of you came learning from me, surely I am knowing better than you. Okay, done. Jealousy will not come. I never get jealous in my life. When someone tells correct answer, I never felt jealous. Therefore, you try. Say, three, four minutes break for me. Okay, done. Try. You try, substitute, try to get this answer. MA. Three, but do one thing. Don't try to substitute something so that you get 357. Not that way. You see where I can account here and get the answer so that your MA should come. Now, instead of 297, 357.17 should come. Try. 3-4 minutes.
Okay. Anybody got the answer? Comment fast. If you do not get, I am there to get it. Don't worry. I will tell the principle. Then, one important concept I will tell. If you want. If you want, I will tell an important concept here. When thinking is there, I will tell you some important concept. If you want. If you want, I will tell. Now, did you try and got it or not getting? Tell me, frankly. Are you able to solve or still not able? You should tell, I give you five minutes time. Are you able to solve and get that answer or still trying? You are not answering. Are you still trying or solved? You should tell one thing. Are you still trying? Oh, yes, true, correct. Are you, are you still trying or solved and got the answer? Okay, you tell, yes, true, we will try, but no, I should continue. What? Got the answer, correct? Got the answer? If you got the answer, tell me, how you got it? How you got it? That let me know. I am getting confused. Okay. Imagine, I am getting confused. So, since you told you got the answer, if you tell me, helpful for me. If you, if you get helpful for if you tell me how you got it, very, you don't have to explain too much. Little hint I can, and sufficient for me, little hint is sufficient. If you don't tell, I will solve them. See, no comment, nothing. Someone told yes, but he is not telling how we got it. See, how it came, he is not telling. Okay. Tell me, what shall I do? Shall I proceed? Tell, type proceed, I will proceed. Don't tell yes now. Now yes means confusing. If you write proceed, I will proceed. If you tell me to proceed further, I will proceed. Means, you did not get the answer. Fast, fast. See, without comment, very problem. You should tell what happened. I proceed, okay. See, remember, I don't know whether you got or not. See, here, consider BDS with the loading. Okay, same as last time. Clear? Same as last time. Once again, right? These all once again, right? Same as last time. Yes or no? Same as last time. Tell me yes or no? BDS with the loading, no change. Same as last time. So, once again, copy it. Don't write live as last time. When you make fair copy, write everything and make a fair copy. Yes. Now, don't go to redundant. Now, consider BDS. See, I will put red color. Consider your BDS important. BDS with given support settlement. Given support settlement. Settlement where? Support settlement where? Not at A. Support settlement where? Support settlement where? Support settlement not at A. Our at B. At B. This is not redundant point. So, your BDS is initially like this. See. Now, A, B. Your B will sink by how much? It sinks by 20 mm. Tell me, how is the elastic curve? If it is a fixed beam, if support settlement comes, curvature will come. Simply supported beam, if support settles, tell what happens? Will there be bending or beam will simply remain straight? Tell me, if, the set, if simply support beam, one side settles, no, no loading, nothing. Only settling. If it is a fixed beam, then curvature will come. Propped canticle also curvature will come. But it will remain straight. Why straight? Because, see there, simply settles here. It will become this way. Okay. Therefore, there will be some rotation here. Yes or no? There will be some rotation at A. Tell yes or no? I will put a big sketch actually, if you want, I will put a big sketch, ready, okay, here, settles by 20 mm, okay, out of scale, this way, 
So there is a clockwise rotation here. Okay, this is your theta a2. Theta, because our purpose is we want rent, we have rent set A. You are, you are bringing medicine. Now you take the medicine due to that 20 mm. See, tan theta a2 equal to what? 20 mm, 20 mm divided by 5, correct? Is tan theta a2 equal to 20 mm by 5, is it correct? Is tan theta a equal to 20 mm by 5, is it correct? Yes, sir. Oh, yo, yo. Correct. Yeah, mathematics is Tan theta a equal to 20 mm by 5 is correct. 20 is in millimeter, 5 is in meter. So, what you should do? No, no. You convert 20 by 1000. So, equal to 20 by 1000 meter. So, 20 by 1000. So, tan theta a2 equal to 20 by 1000 divided by 5. That is it. And you know that in structure engineering, take tan theta equal to theta in radians. Heard of it? You can always take tan theta. See, these all thetas are in radians. Since any deformation is in radians, degree is not allowed. Therefore, you can tell theta a2 equal to 20 by 1000 divided by 5. That much clockwise. Correct? That much clockwise. Correct or not? Tell me. That much clockwise. Correct? Tell me. Correct or not? Direction is important. That much rotation in the clockwise direction. Fast tell me. Yes or no? Correct. Therefore, after this, now consider BDS with the MA. This is same as last time. Therefore, consider theta a equal to 0, clockwise positive. Now your answer is theta a1 plus theta a1. Why? Because it is clockwise. Plus theta a2. Plus theta a2. Uh, one minute. Remember, plus theta a2. Then, lastly, Theta, uh, this, this will become now not theta a2, this will become theta a3. Uh, theta a3 is anticlockwise. Minus theta a3 equal to 0. Substitute theta a1. 495.284 by ei plus 20 by 1000 divided by 5 minus MA into MA into 5 divided by 3 EI equal to 0. Now, EI will not cancel. Now, multiply by EI throughout. What do you get? You get 495.284 plus 20 by 1000 by 5 into EI minus MA into 5 divided by 3 equal to 0. Now you substitute this EI equal to 25,000 kilo Newton meter square. So number, number MA. Therefore, tell what is the value of MA you are getting now. Fast tell me. MA value. Solve correctly. Get MA. It has to come same as last time. Otherwise, no continuation. Solve. MA. Hope procedure fully clear. Tell me. You have to, you require the value of EI now. See, last time EI cancelled. Now, one number has no EI. Multiply by EI. These two will cancel. That will come into EI. 357.17. Plus plus 357.17 kilo newton meter. Correct? Or, therefore, now do one thing. Once again, make a note. Refer the original beam. Sigma m about A0, clockwise positive. Same answer. 
your VB will come. Now you substitute MA equal to 357 point something. VB will come plus 116.966 kilonewton. VA will come to plus 303.034 kilonewton. Therefore, now go for SFD BMD for this case. When you go to SFD BMD for this case, instead of 128.966, enter 116.966. Instead of 291.034, enter 303.034. Instead of 297.17, enter enter 357.17 kilo newton meter. Now, solution is completely over. I will draw SFD BMD. First, I will draw SFD BMD for question 1. Question 1 is when there is no settlement. No settlement. Clear? This I already told you. Shall I go for SFD BMD? Tell me. Shall I go for SFD BMD now? First. Shall I go for SFD BMD now? You should make fair copy systematically. Shall I go to SFD BMD? No. Shall I go to SFD and BMD now? People are coming and going, coming and going. I don't know what is happening. Yes. Okay. One minute now. What you should do is, if you are serious, you should solve the question one and question question one by VB redundant, then same question, solve MA redundant, finish SFD BMD, then write one more question that support B sinks, again solve by VB redundant, again solve by MA redundant, and then draw SFD BMD. Okay, start. Now we are going for SFD BMD. I will not tell too much why there is a limit for explaining SFD BMD. See, stop. I will draw for first one first. This is for first question. SFD. From here, this is childish now. Now, SFD be anything. Go up by, I want black color. Here, go up by how much? 291.034. From here to here, come down by 60 into 1.6. Tell me. When you reach here, what is the value? You go up by 291.034. From here to here, come down by 60 into 1.6. Tell me the ordinate there. I will not explain anything now. Why? If this is to be explained, there is no, no, what you can, what you can tell is, no point in taking the class. After coming to indeterminate structure, if you tell, yes, sir, we have to draw means, I am helpless. 201.034. Then come down by 120. Uh, still you are above the baseline. Answer. Come down by 120. Still you are above the baseline. Answer. Come down by 120. You are still above the baseline. How much ordinate? If anybody asks, sir, not clear means go to SFDBMD classes. This is not the time to discuss about SFD BMD. Hey, tell me, come down by 120. You are not telling any answer. See, 195 from 201.034, when you come down by 120, 195.034, that's the calculator. 201.034, when you come down by 120, it is 195. Innu rupai nuri patu da karchara innu innu rupai dia. Idia o calculator padu. You are forcing me to take calculator. See, first of all, this is wrong. 195 point. See, you are reckless. You are not giving correct answer. I don't know why such mistake happens. You are wrong first time. Okay. Now, Come down by 195. Answer. Okay. How, how mistake will come? Okay. Tell the answer. Come down by 120. Then answer. After coming down 120, answer. Okay. Okay. I correct it. Now answer. 75.034. From 
from here to here gradually come down by 60 into 3.4 100% you will reach here it will cross the baseline here this will be guaranteed little upper side okay okay 195 only this okay 190 120 it will be 128.966 go up by that much this is positive this is negative this is a this is b this is c now there is a new point in sfd i will call the point as d this is the point where sfd crosses baseline tell me you know how to locate shall i explain how to locate that one or shall i put direct answer tell me shall i put direct answer or waste time explaining how to locate tell me shall i waste the time by explaining that location or direct answer direct if you do direct answer the distance you have to calculate do one thing take this as x ayyo here d is here it is d new point take this as x if that is x this will become what if it is a point d this will become 3.4 minus x you can do whatever you want get x value it will come 2.141494 meter sufficient up to second decimal okay Yes, sir. D is over. So this value will be equal to one point two five zero six meter if you calculate. Okay. Now, yes, sir. D is clear. Go for bending moment diagram. Okay. For that, go for bending moment calculation. Remember, this is bending moment, not clockwise, anti-clockwise, sagging positive. Start. bending moment at a equal to look this side minus 297.17 17 kilo newton meter then bending moment at c here you can look either left side or right side if you look left side couple reaction and udl if you look right side only udl and reaction so better look that side so plus 128 bending moment 966 into 3.4 minus 60 into 3.4 into 3.4 by 2 is the bending moment at c in kilo newton meter tell the answer that will give you bending moment at c in kilo newton meter how much answer bm at c fast answer bm at c is to be ka bm at c fast fast look that side whichever side easier do from that side you told direct and no answer is coming one answer required bm at c no cooperation nothing nobody is serious see this way response means very difficult to take live class better go for recorded class then better go for recorded class only It's lot of time is wasted see see i am starting some courses in youtube and first i thought let me do all the course by live streaming now i am decided no live streaming means lot of time wasted and live stream some problem will come recorded means it will come very neatly Plus ninety one point six eight four. Okay, I believe you. Plus ninety one point six eight four. And last next, then bending moment at B equal to zero. Look that side. And also you want bending moment at the point D, at the point D where shear force is zero. Look that side. It is plus one twenty eight point. 966 into 2.1494 minus 
60 into 2.1494 into 2.1494 divided by 2. Tell this answer in kilonewton meter. Tell this answer in kilonewton meter. Tell this answer in kilonewton meter. Answer. It has to come more than 91.684. That is the point of maximum sagging BM. That is the point of maximum sagging BM. Fast answer. 138.666 plus 138.666. Now do one thing. In case I go to an interview and he will give a beam of this type, reactions I can find or he will give reactions. He will ask me, what is the maximum sagging beam for this beam? If I go to an interview, he will tell, he is testing me whether I know correctly how to draw SFD and then locate the point where shear force is crossing the baseline and then how to find the BM there. He is testing me because why? In continuous beam all, see, in all the continuous beam, how BMD will come? SFD will come this way. BMD will come, see, this way it will come. This is the point here. So he is testing me. Continuous beam, maybe he is testing me whether I know how to take moment and etc, etc. Then I will tell him, Sir, do one thing, sir. I want to calculate. I will give my calculator to him. Sir, take this. Because I am telling, Sir, why? He is interviewing me. Sir, take this calculator. He will tell, No, no, I am asking you to calculate. Sir, first do one thing, sir. At least, take the calculator. Okay. Please take, sir. Okay. You take. Square this number. Square this number. Over. Square the reaction. I will tell him, Please square that reaction. Have you squared it? I will tell him, Sir, you please square this reaction. He will start wondering what is happening. Over, tell me, over or not? Square the reaction. Over squared? Yes. Divide by 120. He will ask, what 120? Sir, you divide by 120, sir. That's all. Don't ask me anything. Divide by 120. Please tell me the answer. Tell what he will tell. I will tell him. Please tell me the answer. What he will tell. He calculated is with him. I don't know. I will tell him. Divide by 120. I will ask him. Sir, please tell me what is the answer. Tell me. What answer he will tell. What answer he will tell. He will tell 138.6. I will tell. That is the maximum BM. Eh? Where is shear post diagram? Shear post diagram. All over, sir. All over. Hmm. Most probably, I will not be interviewed. Correct? I will not be interviewed that way. If he interviews, that's what I will do. He will tell, Allah, correct. The answer came correctly. That is because of decimal error. But how you did it? Sir, you asked me what is the maximum BM. I told you. Yes or no? Therefore, please ask next question. Please ask next question. Let us, want, let us not waste time. Please ask next question. Or you tell me, I will ask some questions. Okay, that is asking for too much. Okay, answer came or not? This trick will not work out sometime. Sometime for the trick, you need little observation. You should need some observation. Sometime I will tell, to that one, sir, add this one, I will tell. Or I will tell, see, from that answer, you subtract something. Today I will not tell him. Okay, done. Now see, lastly, draw the BMD. Here BM is negative 297.17, negative. At C, its ordinate is 91 point something. 91 is, this is 297. Half is 150. So still lesser. 91.684. And here bending moment is little more. 138.666. A to C join by parabola. C to B join a single parabola 
which will reach the peak value here, then, oh, sorry, sorry, then it will, see, if you reach the peak value here, I thought support is there, hogging, will become zero, plus, minus. This is the bending moment diagram for the beam. Now, there is a point called point of contraflexion. Imagine, distance is x. Now, if you want that way, I will do one thing, contraflexure point x, to locate point of contraflexure, that is x, you write bending moment at x, here, look this side, is minus 297.17 plus 291.034 into x minus 60 into x into x by 2 equal to 0. Solve the quadratic value. Your x has to come less than 1.6 meter. Solve the quadratic. Get the value of x and enter here. Then lastly, if I plot here, from here to here, beam will hog. Then onwards, beam will sag. This is the elastic curve. Is the solution completely clear? X is not required. You solve yourself only. Is solution completely clear? <laughs> no, that is, that trick it requires, I cannot tell now. That trick it requires some observation. Every problem it will not work out. Every, I cannot tell wrong information. 1.1597. 1.1597. Okay. Uh, if the, so therefore, remember, if it is an RCC beam, then you require top steel here, AST for bending moment M of what? 291.034. Here, if it comes WI in post, you require AST. Here, for sagging, you require bottom AST for BM of how much? For BM of 138.666. That is to connect with RCC. Containment of bar, we are not bothered here. Is solution completely clear? Tell me. Is solution completely clear? Okay. Now, I will wind up prop cantilever with one, ah, one minute. I will tell an important information for you. See. Important information for you. If you want, tell me. Some concept is there. If you want, I will tell. Otherwise, I won't tell. Tell me. Do you want one important concept which practically required? This is regarding settlement. See, in case of foundation, when settlement is there, soil pressure will change. Okay. Now, see. Information for you. This is the cantilever beam. This is a cantilever. UDL is here. And point load is here. There is a support here. See. First time, I took rigid support. Yes or no? I took rigid support first time. At that time, your VB came how much? Tell me. Your VB came how much? When you took rigid support, how much VB came? Tell the answer. The reaction at B came. Answer. When the support is rigid, that is unyielding, no displacement, 128.966, 128.966 kilometer. Now, but what happened later is, later we solve the same question when that support is not rigid. It is what? Tell me. Support sinking means what? Support thinking means what? It is not rigid. It is what? Tell me. Support thinking means, see, foundation sinks on soil. Same way, beam will sink because of contraction of the column. Slab will sink because contraction or displacement of beam. It is yielding or flexible. Or second time, can I call that support something like this? Something like this imagination. Can I call this something like, can you take it? Something like that, a spring. 
very hard spring see very very solid spring but it has got some flexibility yes now when the load is transferred the spring will contract by how much tell me how much the spring will contract by how much right like when the beam is supported by a column all when the column is resting on the soil slight deformation settlement how much 20 mm tell me when it sinks by 20 mm support reaction increases or decreases don't see the answer now your support reaction came how much 116.966 kN 116 16.966 kilo newton tell you sir no now your support settlement is now reaction came 116.966 means it is reduced by how much tell me it is reduced by how much reduced by how much reduced by 12 kilo newton 12 kilo newton okay earlier what va came va came 291.034 now your va came what 303.034 so this sorry this reaction reduced by 12 kN this reaction increased by 12 kN that is 12 kN load it what load was transferred last time that much load is not transferred in 12 kn load was less transferred it came to this one in case of column resting on soil if under any column if the column sinks then column load will become more for other column clear now if one column is firm other column sinks then for the rigid column load become slightly more for the sinking column load will become slightly lesser clear clear or not load will become slightly lesser or in case of soil if uniform settlement is there there is no effect but if non uniform settlement is there where settlement comes pressure become lesser where it is hard pressure becomes more where settlement takes place pressure will be relieved pressure is relieved other places pressure will increase clear tell me practical knowledge clear or not it is a practical knowledge clear or not ah uh, correct if one leg is injured other legs takes extra load see if you are correct good answer if both legs are okay you walk correctly if one is injured then injured leg you apply lesser load other leg you are having more strain correct now i will tell you what is the reason for reduction see reaction is what reaction is always what reaction comes when displacement is i told you in the beginning of the class bsk class or every course i tell whether you come to rcc whether you come to steel whether you come to eat apps and shape or you come to bsk any subject you come starting i tell basic concept there i tell reaction always comes when displacement is reaction always comes where displacement is what reaction always comes when displacement is i used a word at that time tell what reaction always comes when displacement is i used a word fast fast i told in every subject those who came to my offline class also i told it online class or offline class any subject i take starting day i give introduction i will tell reaction always comes when displacement is ayyo why this much delay fast fast reaction always comes when displacement is you are not answering the question i used a word if you don't know tell don't know don't waste time if you don't know tell don't know i will tell the answer 
no point in wasting time i have i thought at least one of you will remember or if forgot me i will tell if you have forgotten i will tell okay i told reaction always comes when displacement is prevented see i give a simple example like i will take this wooden part here see i will go this way displacement is allowed tell me any reaction i am moving here displacement is allowed any reaction tell me any reaction displacement is allowed any reaction no finally i will go and tap the board now if i further if i apply the load down is displacement allowed tell me is displacement allowed no when finally i will tap the board when i tap the board now still if i move is displacement allowed no no is displacement allowed after touching the board not allowed why tell me because displacement is prevented what comes from the board displacement is prevented tell me what comes from the board till that time board was sleeping now what comes from the board finally when i move to the board touch it no no action is you are applying what comes from the board reaction comes now suppose the board slightly yields slightly yields then reaction will become more or less sir if it slightly yields reaction increases or decreases reaction slightly yields slightly yields reaction reduces fully yields the board will escape then no reaction see best example two people fighting when someone comes fighting to you if you solidly stand this way you give maximum reaction but if you slightly back out tell me if you back out when he is hitting this way suppose you back out your body you move your body slightly away tell me you get lesser effect or higher effect when somebody hits you if he hits you you slightly move away will it be you advantage or disadvantage he is hitting you when he is hitting you you slightly move backwards is it advantage or disadvantage advantage why that means when you move your reaction become lesser that's why when support settles here that reaction came lesser then the total load has to be transferred how much that reaction got reduced that much this reaction got increased so that total is 16 into 5 plus 120 clear clear or not clear or not clear or not and also see moment earlier rotation is only due to udl and point load now when the support sinks it will try to rotate more that's why moment also increased or now i will tell you something see something those who want to understand another extra point want it or not tell me want it or not one small concept want or not small concept if you want i will tell yes see imagine propped cantilever propped cantilever this way prop sinks by delta elastic curve now remember it is not bds real fixed end elastic curve will come like this if the fixed beam is there if it sinks by delta elastic curve comes this way here this way so then this moment will be see here this moment will be equal to you will be knowing later when the far end is propped if the prop he when the far end is fixed if it is a fixed end if it sinks later you will be knowing in the class i am driving these moments are anybody can tell if support sinking takes place 
for a fixed beam. Can you tell the end moments? If support sinking takes place for a fixed beam, can you tell the end moment? Can you tell the end moment formula? We are not covered. It will come in further chapters. Uh, it is 6EI delta by L square. 6EI delta by L square. But here, if it is one, both are fixed. If one is fixed, one is prop, no moment here, this will be 3EI delta by L square. It is a formula. You today, you believe me. Today you believe me. Or if I substitute equal to 3 into 25,000 into delta is 20 by 1000 divided by 5 square. Tell this moment in kilo Newton meter. Tell what is the anti-clockwise moment developed at the fixed end when support B sinks by 20 mm. Answer. Tell the answer. When the prop sinks by 20 mm, how much fixed end moment will come, reacting moment will come at the fixed end? Calculate. Answer. That formula, today you believe me. Today you believe me. You believe me today. 60 kilo Newton meter. Now, now, if a couple of 60 is applied anti-clockwise here, reaction will come down here, reaction will come up here. The reaction is equal to m by l, m by l. So divide this 60 by 5, tell the reaction. 60 by 5, this is a standard result. If you apply a couple anywhere in the span, rea reactions are m by l, m by l, you know it. 60 by 5, how much? 12 kilo newton. Here, 12 kilo newton up, 12 kilo newton down. Therefore, what answer you got last time when settlement was not there, because of this down 12, that much load is released. Tell me, 128.966 minus 12. Are you getting the same reaction? Tell me. If you subtract 12 from here, are you getting the secondary second answer? If you subtract 12, are you getting the reaction given second answer? No, no. From the previous answer, if you subtract 12, yes. To this answer, already up, further up by 12. You add 12. Are you getting VA reaction increased? Yes. And last time moment, 297. Now, extra 60. Extra 60. When you add extra 60, is it coming? 357.27. Yes or no? Yes or no? Coming or not? This is the extra concept you should know. Clear now? Extra concept you should understand. Is it, is it clear the concept I told? Is it clear the concept I told? Okay, now, tomorrow I am starting fixed beam. So, I will do one thing. Instead of wasting time, shall I take up a little more time and give a problem with the overhang and give brief solution. Can you solve? Tell the answer. Can you solve? Nothing is there. I will tell you how to solve. Can you solve? I will tell you a question with the overhang. Because so many cases in building solve, beyond the prop then, overhang will be there. Shall I give? It won't take much time. It won't take much time. Otherwise, tomorrow I will put title fixed beam. Okay. Start. See, I will give a question here. Remember, you had solved fully today. It is somewhat like homework. Mini homework. See, question. I will not give too much complication. Simple question I will give you. There is a prop to cantilever. A beam, a, a beam is fixed at the left end and a beam of total length, I will tell you, total length, this is 6 meter, other than the yard meter, total length, 12 meter, total length, 12 meter, is fixed at left end and propped at 2 meter from right end. Therefore, tell me, what is this span? First, this span, I will call A, this is B, this is C. What is the span? 
that's pan beam of length it's 8 meter 10 meter i told beam of length 8 meter is fixed at left end and propped at 2 meter from right end this pan 10 meter ayyo i told a beam of length 8 meter beam is of length 8 meter there is a beam of length 8 meter 6 meter okay now it is loaded by udl of any udl full udl udl of say 20 kilo newton per meter 20 meter i will put a uh, udl of uh, 18 kilo newton per meter between the two support at a point load of on do 36 kilo newton at the free end i want a function of 18 so that value comes easily okay this is a cool analyze and sketch sfd and dmd okay start first copy the question uh, clear first copy the question i will tell the steps now it won't take much time first copy the question no no over agreed uh, okay then right then right one more sketch here there is a reaction called vb here there is a reaction called va a reacting moment called ma therefore right this is a proper cantilever with overhang remember overhang has nothing to do with indeterminacy therefore tell me statically indeterminate to what degree tell me statically indeterminate to what degree tell fast i will finish today so that tomorrow i start fixed beam statically indeterminate to what degree first degree tell me first degree you choose redundant tell which one choose a redundant which one choose a redundant which one redundant shall I, don't waste take m here redundant normal problem solve we be redundant take we be redundant we be redundant now therefore compatibility condition to be satisfied at b is displacement at b delta b vertical deflection vertical deflection equal to zero correct vertical deflection equal to zero tell yes or no display vertical displacement equal to zero correct tell me correct or not compatibility is vertical deflection equal to zero yes or no what uh, yes now right basic structure usually in basic structure over hangs are not considered you maintain a fixed and b free only ab not only ab for 6 meter is basic determinate structure don't consider over hang then first consider the basic structure with the loading see there a here and b here there is a udl here of what 18 see the overhang is there while during solution don't consider 18 km per meter and then remember not over this 36 kilo out and here you shift it here it will become a point load of 36 kilo newton and a couple of tell me how much and it will give a couple of how much tell me you remove that overhang effect you we want displacement for bds at b we are not interested what happens beyond b we want what happens here for that remove this load shift it here for displacement purpose 36 down and a couple of couple of how much a point load 36 shift it down shift it to b a couple of 72 kilo newton meter 72 kilo newton meter okay now start now this beam see now correctly this beam will bend like this i want this deflection this delta b 1 it is 100% down equal to this now i am not explaining one by one 
write formula directly. See, I solve fully. I told mini homework. Due to UDL, W L power four by eight E I plus due to point load, W L cube by three E I due to couple M L square by two E I. Ah, tell the answer. Something divided by E I. Tell the answer. Eight star is six meter. Eighteen into six power four divided by eight plus thirty six into six cube divided by three plus seventy two into six square divided by two. You should calculate because it is homework. Answer. Eighteen into six power four divided by eight. Plus thirty six into six cube divided by three plus seventy two into six square divided by two. Is it six eight zero four? Is it six eight zero four? Check the answer. Fast, fast. I want to finish the question now. I want to finish the question now, so that tomorrow I can start fixed and fixed beam. Is it six eight zero four? Okay, six eight zero four. Six eight zero four. Okay, now, now consider the basic structure with redundant VB. VB, the beam will surely go up. This is upward displacement delta B two equal to what? VB into L cube by three EI. Now, therefore, you are. Displacement at B equal to zero. Take upward positive. You get what? Plus V B into L cube six cube divided by three E I E minus six eight zero four by E I equal to zero. Tell me the V B value. Tell me the V B value. Tell me the V B value. Tell me the VB value. Tell me the VB value. Correctly, VB value. Don't give wrong answer. Six eight zero four into divided by three. Six eight zero four into three divided by six cube. Six eight zero four into three divided by six cube. VB. First, first. I will complete the question now because just the question of five minutes more, only five minutes more required. Why should I keep for tomorrow? Six eight zero four into three by six cube. This much time. Six eight zero four into three divided by six cube. You are wasting lot of time. Ninety four point five. Don't give wrong value. Plus ninety four point five. Now. Once you get to VB, you completely forget about all these things. What? Determinate, indeterminate, theta, delta, adu, idu, isko, usko, this one, that one. Our structure has got MA, VA, and VB, including Warren. This is our structure. Do one thing. Refer to original beam and. Sigma m about y equal to zero. Take clockwise positive. Answer. Minus v b into six. Minus v b into six. Plus thirty six into six plus. Now orange is there. Now orange is there. Now you forget this one. Now see original. Plus thirty six into eight. Plus eighteen into six into. Six by two minus m y equal to zero. Therefore, tell me the value of m y fast. Where v b comes, substitute ninety four point five. Fast, tell me m y value. M y value. Tell me M A value. Part part over question. Just start give S M D B M D. In two minutes I will draw it. 
you can try later in front of you i will draw so that this can be a homework fast tell me mea value ಇಷ್ಟೊತ್ತು ಬೇಕು ಅಮ್ಮಿಯ ಕೊಡೋಕ್ಕೆ ಸಪ್ಟ್ಯೂಡ್ ವಿ ಬಿ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ನೈಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಫೈವ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಮೈನಸ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಫೈವ್ ಇಂಟು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಎಮ್ ಎ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಕಿಲೋ ನ್ಯೂಟನ್ ಮೀಟರ್ ಫಾರ್ಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಕೆ ಎನ್ ಮೀಟರ್ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಸಿಗ್ಮಾ ವಿ ಝೀರೋ ಅಪ್ವರ್ಡ್ ಪಾಸಿಟಿವ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ವಿ ಎ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ವಿ ಬಿ ಮೈನಸ್ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ಇಂಟು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಮೈನಸ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಝೀರೋ ಬೇರ್ ಪೋರ್ ಟೆಲ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ವಿ ಎ ಸಿ ಏಯ್ಟೀನ್ ಇಂಟು ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ಸಿಕ್ಸ್ ಸಬ್ಟ್ರಾಕ್ಟ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಫೋರ್ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಫೈವ್ ಟೆಲ್ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ವಿ ಎ ಟೆಲ್ ದಿ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ವಿ ಎ ಟೆಲ್ ಮಿ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ವಿ ಎ ಟೆಲ್ ಮಿ ದ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಆಫ್ ವಿ ಎ ಓವರ್ ದೆನ್ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ಲಿ ಎಸ್ ಎಫ್ ಡಿ ಬಿ ಎಂ ಡಿ ದೋಸ್ ವಾಂಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಟ್ರೈ ವಾಟ್ ಬೈ ಎಂ ಎ ರೆಂಡೆಂಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯು ಟ್ರೈ ಇಫ್ ಯು ವಾಂಟ್ can you try m r redundant 49.5 49.5 kn later those who are interested can you solve by m r redundant then first m i will come 45 will you try we 49.5 if you want alternately m r redundant can you try tell me if you are interested can you try m r redundant after the class then due to the couple slope at a is ml by 6 ei this point load directly come to support no slope okay now suppose somebody will ask me what is the reacting moment at a for this beam i will tell take your calculator 18 into 4.5 tell the answer 18 into 4.5 minus 18 into 4.5 minus 36 what is the answer 18 into 4.5 minus 36 what is the answer answer first 18 into 4.5 minus 36 what is the answer 18 into 4.5 minus 36 what is the answer correct Yes or no? I told, if somebody asks me for this beam, I want MA. Okay, how will you solve it? What do you want? MA, no? 18 into 4.5 minus 36 will be the answer. 45, how you got it? Ayyo, you wanted answer, I told the answer. Hmm. That means there are lot of, lot of, lot of tricks are there. Yes or no? Are you agreeing? indeterminate structure especially propped cantilever saw lot and lot and lot of tricks are there are you agree there are tricks but these are required for competitive examination okay now lastly instead of closing as it is i will draw sfd bmd and close this question okay here see can i i will not explain further more this is the beam 6 meter reaction over and 2 meter this is 6 meter this is 2 meter udl of 18 kilo newton per meter point load of 36 kilo newton reaction vb you got ishtadu 94.5 kilo newton reaction va you got ishtadu va 49.5 kilo newton ma you got ma you got 45 kilo newton meter see draw the sfd go up by 49.5 come down by 18 into 6 49.5 minus 18 into 6 56.6 it is 56.6 then 56 58.6 allah 58.5 it is 58.5 go up by 94.5 this is 36 
no load, come back. Draw the bending moment diagram. This point you have to locate. Locate from here. That will come. Two point seven five meter. You calculate. Bending moment A minus forty five. Bending moment this point zero. Bending moment here minus thirty six into two minus seventy two. And bending moment here is forty nine point five square divided by thirty six minus forty five plus twenty three point here twenty three point. Zero six two five will come. Then one counterfactual here, one counterfactual here. If you want take x one here, take x two here. If you want locate the counterfactual, elastic curve will be hog, sag, hog, and only hog. This elastic curve. You solve those who are serious. You take M A and then your B D S T simply support beam compatibility theta A equal zero hundred percent your M A will come forty five solve it sufficient you understood the basic analysis of propagand lever that's what required in this course not time waste questions see we are already in class number two hundred and ten what I promised earlier is B S K class I have taken more than double. I told around 120 hours. 120 hours, sir. It has gone more than two 210 class means what? More than 300 hours. No? Nearly, see, nearing 300 hours. What I committed earlier, more than double. Still class going on. Uh, can you try? Tell me. Can you try later? Shall I stop now? So that tomorrow I will start fixed beam. Very important fixed beam because why? Both are fixed. One critical question, not this way. How I solved last time? Systematically I will solve. Okay, thank you.